Hello guys, and welcome back. Uh, guys, today we're testing uh, Eternal Tomes. It's a new MMORPG in development. Uh, I just guessed uh, two days ago invite an email to to test the game. It's a play test uh, alpha beta, I think, for the game. So I didn't see any gameplay, only a little bit the trailer and uh, some description that I received on the email. Please subscribe to YouTube channel. Really appreciate for more content and let's let's play. Let's test this game. Uh, okay, and uh, ability, inventory, profession, option, quest, blah 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 blah. Welcome to Mithir, the land of eternal tombs, Dragon Norox, the sole essence of all evil, creates out his hand upon you and darkness your mind. Okay, I have table 60. What the? <laughs> so, you think you can come against me? I shall grind your bones to dust. What the hell was that? What the hell was that? Uh, man, on the options, if I press escape, I have only that to quit. No options. Oh, here. And abilities. Wait. Oh. Wow. Profession, herbalism, ore, cooking, skin, metal forging, alchemy, weapons, me, tailoring, woodworking, a lot of professions. Uh, oh, you need to press O for the settings. Okay. We have everything on Epic. Okay, on G you have main quest, side quest completed. On F, what on F? I don't know. On L, oh, the group. Okay. Abilities secondary attack from shield. Heavy attack. Okay, let, let's let's explore. Uh, a little bit bl motion blur. Exactly, man. Me too. Wait. Where is? Uh, motion blur off. Yeah, the motion motion blur g give me sickness, man. Hello, my friend. I saw you struggling there for a moment. Ignore the visions and the voices. Voice acting. It's just Dragnarox, and he does it to all of us. Whenever you have them, it usually means something bad just happened nearby. So just be aware of that and keep your guard up. Anyway, I know you are a follower of the Triune, as he told me you were coming. I need to warn you, however, that you must never tell anyone that you believe in the Triune. The Valem, those who practice magic, will kill you instantly if they were to find out who you serve. I'll keep you safe and will train you and guide you, but you must be very, very careful. There's enough murder and mayhem in the world that many of the Valem won't know that you stand against Dragnarox by killing things, as they simply uh, kill someone over a game of Tadok. Nonetheless, you must still be careful. This world is full of Vilem and those loyal to Dragnarox, far more than those of us who love the Triune. Let's start by killing a few things to see what you're made of, and then we'll go from there. Bring me back a baby Vikewing. Okay, baby Vikewing. Oh, that's a player. Hello, buddy. 
Graphics looks good, by the way. What's that? A binding. Uh, by the way, what I understand from the email, the this guy's was inspired from uh, EverQuest, which is which is good. That's player, huh? Is it a vendor? Oh no. Inspect. Oh, look, you can inspect the other players. Man, I remember that from EverQuest, from WoW. Uh, I want to interact with the vendor. Anyway, I don't have any money to buy anything. Cooking. Oh, that's a fucking snake. Hey! Wait, I can block? No. Welcome to level 2 uh, How are the points? Attack with the off hand, block with your shield. Give your enemy ugly flower for their own man. I don't like that uh, the, the, the writing, it's too small. I don't know, you don't read easily, but that's a UI problem, I think. I think this uh, can be fixed. By the way, I chose at the beginning uh, a mage. Where I can... S I, don't, I don't get the points or anything when I level up. was a heavy attack. Yeah, that's uh, the font art detail that can be fixed easily later. Oh, harvesting. Cooper. That's not a flower to collect. Uh, man, I how many wings I need?
Bring me back a baby wing. I have that. I need one, I think, huh? I completed that quest. I want to complete that quest because I want to go to explore. Did you get the baby Vikewing? Yes, I did. Well, my friend, you looked all right. You're not going to kill any full-size Vikes anytime soon, <laughs> but we can work with it. Also, I want you to worry, as Drangorox haunts all of our minds. His magic is far too dark and powerful, and I will never understand. It's very small, I suppose. You you cannot read is. what uh, are on the, the trial description now, you know, the right? World, we will because always it's too be small. subjected to his torturous methods and mind games. It is something that is very difficult it's to deal with. It's good to have a voice acting. Brings me to but for reading, I think it's too small. Sometimes. Um, Ailey, I, I know you have come to join our fight against him and his minions. Let's get right to it. You can kill some things, but you are definitely young and seem pretty inept. So I, uh, I'm, I'm just being honest. I'm going to have you practice a bit more on these small creatures right here and teach you to survive in this evil world. Here's the weapon for you. It should help you in your quest. Five rat Kill meat. Them and bring back five pieces of rat meat. Full size screen. Uh, oh. This has four damage. How to equip? Hey, Anorana, good morning. Uh, this is one handed empty room stone. It's good the, the tool for mining you need don't need to equip manually uh, I need to kill some rats huh these snakes are friendly Low, the heavy attack is crazy. Don't have any loot. Bro, how the hell to heal? Huh? There is not an option to rest or something to heal? What I get when uh, when I level up, my health regenerate by default. Oh yes, 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 yes. Yes, but uh, I'm sure will be some kind of healing, you know.
Come. How many I have? I need one more. Hope I don't die. One more stupid rat. Naked when <laughs> ah, he didn't drop. Nobody, what's here? A, a catapult, There's some kind of village. No loot here. No loot. Are you kidding me? Man, the heavy attack is, <laughs> is broken. Okay, got it. Got it. The graphic is nice. Uh, how to use that uh, teleportation? I just get beam. No. Cam, quit the game. I need to check uh, the option to see how to teleport uh, back to the shrine when I bind. Where I bind. You have the rat meat, do you? Yeah. Wonderful. Now you can gather some food and give yourself some strength. Collect some more rat meat and then head down the hill a bit and you'll see a monstrous looking fellow with a merchant stand. He's as ugly as they get, but he's incredibly nice and a super good cook. Grab a recipe for kebabs, grab a couple onions and some bl blue sedatius, and then bring all your ingredients back here to cook a fine kebab over this fire. We can't use magic, so you'll need to be a pretty resourceful cracker and cook to stay alive out there. Uh. What are you looking for? What recipe he did? Wow. By the way, uh, Renux, from what I uh, read on the email that I received from the developers, Everything you need to discover, you buy the recipe from the guy, but you don't have idea what exactly the property of the item that you made. For example, if you buy a recipe to, to craft a one-handed sword, you don't see the damage, you don't see anything. Everything depends on the material that you use. So you, I can craft a different one-handed sword that your crafted one-handed sword. You know, which is uh, it's nice. Thank you. Yeah, it sounds good. Uh, what that guy say to buy? Ability tone. I don't have the money anyway. Wow! Look at all this thing. Are you fucking kidding me? Oh, this is, these are skills that you need to buy to learn. Primitive food. Uh, 
Well, what what the hell he say? Thank you. Welcome. Uh, okay. Grab a recipe for kebabs. Grab a couple of onions and blue sadish, and then bring all the ingredients back here to cook. Uh, yes, but where I will find the recipe for kebab? Huh? It's somewhere here, or I need to buy from this guy. What are you looking for? I'm looking for a uh, kebab. Recipe minor healing potion. Pickpocket. That's only ability. There are only abilities and down here are some recipe, but I don't see a kebab. Recipe, minor healing potion, helmet, leather gloves, leather shoes. What the hell is the kebab? Thank you. Thank you for what? Did you get the kebab, man? I don't... <laughs> How the hell to cook, man? It was off of some big ugly guy, what do you mean? Wait, you have a chat? I see. Get the hell out of here. Maybe I need to go uh, at that camp there, over there, down, that village, or in town. Maybe it's another vendor here. Man, the graphics look so good, Renox, what do you think? Huh? Looks amazing. Honestly, and uh, I have a very stable 60 frames. But there are a lot of mushrooms. What the heck is here? The Everquest, yeah, I, what it, uh, I, I told you what I uh, read on the email from the publishers. The inspiration for the game is Everquest. They, they say they want to make the best MMORPG, old school MMORPG. Now let's see, but from what I play, looks looks good. This shop is available for lease? Wow! Look at the price, 100, the, the, the highest one.
Greens, you old bird. If you think I'm gonna hail that old britchin' wizard, you can think again. That Dilge Smith are real in my life. And I'm impressed in the full voice actor. In, but for some reason, I don't think you will. I'm sick of that piece of rich. He can go die for all I care. I know these are words that would get me executed, but uh, I have a good feeling about you. Maybe if you did turn me in, that arrow like ticking the knee still gives me terrible pain, so at least I'll get rid of that if they hang me. Henry, listen, I need some supplies for the. Uh, I'm sorry, the some trades that I need to make here and some money. I'm desperately low on goblin urine. I, I know it's disgusting, but uh, that stuff is just amazing for mixing a poison. Okay. I'm making a poison. I, I would collect the, I just, gobl I just goblin a urine. <laughs> so, uh, you gotta collect some for me, eh? I'll be hugely helpful. I'll make sure you get something good for it. Did you get Lisa some urine? No. You know what I'm surprised as well, Linus? I still hear anything about this game. Hurry, come here. There's something very wrong and unnatural happening within this region of Mathir. I don't know what it is. But yeah, oh, this is not... A feeling I, get I think it's I get AI, but Eastern it's world. still better than Someone nothing. Someone who can I don't... The presence of, evil of, of course, we cannot... Uh, they are cooking up something over there. We cannot compare the voice acting with the Baldur's Gate or, or I don't know, exactly. Witcher voice there are acting. rumors of a cave, but I'll need you to go explore and see if you can find anything over there behind us. Maybe see if you can find an evil spirit. I'm guessing it's deep within. It's better than nothing. Man, but look at the... I'm sure the buildings... You know that these buildings are assets. You know? I'm sure are assets. But... Looks amazing and... Feel very, very well in the game. Look at that, it's great man. Looks great. What the heck is that man? Oh you can play on first person as well. What the heck? Look at that guy! Bro! You look so cool! Nice bikini! You say he sell my kebab. Are you kidding me? Look at that. It's one gold, five silver and two copper. Uh... I, I, I sell. I don't sell the resources, you know? So this guy sell my uh, my kebab. It's nice, man. I didn't know it. Look at that. You can play on first person as well. What are you doing, bro? Stealing? Are you cooking the, the bat? What the heck? Wow, man, looks so cool. Look at that. What are you doing here? Lease a shop. Yeah, honestly, Renuk, this, this is the kind of MMORPG that I can play. 
Because have that uh, old school vibe. What? That's a chest? One platinum. Look how much gold I found. One platinum. Wow. I can buy the receipt from uh, that guy. That's a dinosaur. Uh... Let's go to the big, uh, big guy. He's not ugly, bro. He's cute. Give me the kebab, man. I have money now. And I still have nine gold. But what I need now to craft the kebab Wait, you need to read that? Yeah, you have a lot. So, five meat, two onions, and two blue satish. Uh, uh, where I find that? Oh, maybe this guy's... Did you maybe. get this mirror Maybe after I complete the author quest from this guy, they will sell. Did you find the spirit? Or, well, or this guy sell ingredients as well. Okay, meat, I can find meat from animal. But onion and saddish? Oh, blue saddish. And onion. Okay, let's get the meat. And maybe in that time we complete the author quest for the author guys. Then, but I don't know what I get when I level up. I don't get points, I don't get anything. What the? Oh. Oh, 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 they are not friendly anymore here. My God. Uh, game? I'm in the sky. Okay. Okay. That's not good. Uh... What you lose when you die, so looks like you don't drop your loot, which is good. Which is good, but I will try to go where I died at my body to see. Is free to play? Uh, Darka, I don't know, but um, because I received an invitation for alpha test from the publisher, for the moment, it's not released the game yet. It's, uh, it's still in development. But uh, from what I understand from the developers, I don't think we'll be free to play. I don't know, I have no idea. I cannot say yes or not. 
But my first impression looks very, very good, man. They say the, the inspiration for the game is EverQuest. Is that kind of old school uh, MMORPG. Uh, check the Steam page and maybe you can apply for the playtest version. I don't know. Maybe everyone can apply. Who didn't love EverQuest, man? Who? You killed me, motherfucker. You killed me. You have meat? No. Uh, these guys don't drop... Uh... Man, I, I need to... I need to advance to, to get some spells, some better weapon to pull enemies. Hey piggy. This pig is level 4. No way. This guy will kill me. These rats up here, I can drop them in. What is here? It's another shop? When the health regeneration is a problem, you need to learn to craft that potions or to have uh, the healing potion or to have a spell. Oh, you give me a bow? Hail Dragnarox. We're practicing to hunt down and kill followers of the Triune. So you think you can shoot, eh? How on earth can you shoot when you don't even own a bow? You dumb filker. <laughs> anyway, child, I'll help you out a bit. Go find us some supplies and I'll give you this crusty old bow so you can at least pretend like you know what you're talking about. Give me ten copper flecked pieces of ore and I'll give you this bow. Okay, you give me a bow. I think I have some. Uh, I I have one. He wants ten, and he will give me a bow. I cannot loot your bow. I cannot steal your bow. If they don't drop meat, try apple. Yeah, that, that's good, man. Good point. Uh, I know that rats here drop meat. Uh, Dark Axe, you check the page, it's, uh, you can apply for, uh, for the playtest, anyone can apply, it's free to apply. Found one meat. Mm. 
Bring some apple, be right back, okay? Enjoy your apple. Level four, boys. I think I need to complete that kind of tutorial too. But looks like everything you need to learn, every ability you need to buy and learn. Nobody. Yeah. Nice armor. Uh, uh, that's the other guy here in the village one. Goblin urine. It'd be amazing to get that ten uh, Cooper for the guy with the bow. This is a Cooper, I think. Yeah. Up to what level is that? Uh, is level three this rat? A sickly rat. Of course, he don't drop anything. What's here? Wow, nice lake! Oh crap! Okay. Oh, oh, we can go underwater. But we cannot jump. Uh, jump space is not jump is properly it's a dodge okay this is a jump now shift it a little bit Are you kidding me? You cannot go ahead, go, go here. No, no, don't get stuck here. Some loot underwater? Man, that chest that I found was amazing with one platinum. What the heck? Oh, 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 what the fuck are you? Orgy Leaper. I, I, I'm sure 
one hit from this guy and I'm, I'm dead oh my god nothing no loot are you kidding me ah oh. and this guy was level five Yeah, me too. I expected I will get a spear or something. Uh, yeah, I think the goblins are here, but I think they are high level. I need to complete that quest to get the bow to pull. You know, to pull uh, level 4 pigs. Hey. Uh, this bucked bunny is aggressive, I think. Hey, bunny. Yeah. I'm dead. How the hell lost the aggro? Fucking meat, where is the bunny? Where is the where is the bunny? Where is Buck's bunny? Where is the body? Ah oh, here you are. No meat, are you kidding me man? Pretty hard here without armor, without with nothing, basically, and without healing. I have no idea which mob are aggressive and which one no. Come on. One by one, motherfucker. Man, they don't drop anything. I I need to I need to go to farm that rats for meat. And I need to find a cooper for uh, for the bow. Bow will be very useful. But I suppose you need the uh, arrows as well. This is Cooper. Man, the bats. The bats drop meat. No, drop only only wings. Or nothing. Oh, but you get some money, by the way, anyway, from, uh, 
from every loot. It looks like the money are going automatically on your inventory. That's Cooper, which is good. Hey, rat, 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 rat. He broke meat, meat. Give me the meat. Oh, come on, man. Hey, Chucky. This time, let me kill the rat. Man, are you kidding me? That meat is very hard to stop. Stop. No way, man. Let me see if we can go in that town. By the way, I have more damage now. Oh, finally, on me. How much many? I had three. I need two more. Hello, guys. What? Loading? You go on another area? Welcome to the trade corner. We don't have a map. Hello! Hey buddy, it's a goblin. Yeah, everything, you know, I think everything looks a little bit too static. But I don't bother too much. Because it looks cool. This shop. You can buy a shop. And sell your... Your things. In the town. Here is like a... A trade hub. One hundred platinum. your shop up here bro are you crazy why, why, why you have your shop here you didn't get space down I 
cannot trade with any of these traders. I think these are only only players can. Uh, oh, ugly wood. I have nine gold. Went to buy for a better weapon, a rock bill set, wand of magic, mysterious set, reinforced with shot. I don't know to buy something. If you Uh, I have no idea. I spend the gold, man. We have learned a new result, and how can see now? How I can... Uh... Everything have a hmm. foraging, mortar and pestle, bundling. Wow, man. Uh, uh. What is a oh, wand of magic? Oh, look at that. So you need 18 woods and 5 seeds. Wow. I bought the wand, but for the wood. This is uh, advanced runescape, by the way. Can I take the wood from here? A hidden chest. Yeah, it looks like in town you, you can only craft here. Man, but I can, you cannot see the map in this game. I didn't see the map. If I'm pressing M, appear only the coordinates on the, on the chat. Yeah, it looks. I think it's a. It's very grindy. Meat. Yes. 
I need one more. Yes, boy. Uh, now let's go to the ugly guy, the big vendor down here to buy uh, two onions, I think, and two radish or something. You have fall damage? I don't know. I don't think. Uh, cooking kebab, two onion and uh, two blue saddish. Give me two onion and two blue saddish. Uh, and now let's uh, cook. Let's go to the guy where I need to deliver the quest. To cook a kebab. Wow, there are one million of rats here. The cooper will be important. So this is really old school hardcore if you don't have any kind of map to complete the quest it will be very challenging I need a keeper. What? Interrupted? I need ten coopers for the quest. Did you get the kebab made? No, I will meet now. Ooh. Where is the kebab? Bro. Where's my kebab? Okay, and now, guys, I don't understand what that mini game. When you need to add the ingredients Ah Oh okay Wow that's cool No 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 wait I did it! An excellent and tasty kebab. Heal 65 damage. That's... that's a lot. Did you get the kebab made? I have one. Excellent. You have done great. Now, being a good meat flesher is a pretty rare talent. And their work is worth more than the largest sums of plat. 
but you can at least skip the basics to keep yourself healthy. Go ahead and eat it when we're done here. It'll strengthen you to kill some of these nasty creatures. Now I want to talk to you about something incredibly important. I know you've heard it all your life, but now that you are learning to fight, it will be more tempting to give in, especially when you are in the most dire of circumstances. Never, and I mean this seriously, never summon magic from within yourself. This will lead you down a path you cannot come back from. Learn to use the resources from the world around you. You can use I'm magic amazed, items bro. or craft magic things, but never summon magic from within. If you do, it'll consume your soul and you will give yourself over to Dragnarox. Magic will warp you by twisting your body, polluting your mind, and he'll turn out looking like a Death Seeker. And if you've never seen a Death Seeker, well, let's just say you've never experienced more awful sight in all of your life. There are men who gave into Kenpatian and are now trapped in Dragnarox's army, flesh and mind rotting away. Absolutely awful. In fact, that's what all of Dragnarox's minions are. Warped living beings, either created by magic or destroyed by it. Take a moment and purchase the abilities you want to learn from the vendor in the tent over there. Try them out on the enemies, and I'm also going to give you this runestone. Runestones are stones that allow you to summon magic. Attach them to your weapons and armor, and then you could use their magic very similar to your abilities. Head into trade port. You'll notice an altar with the swirling stones around it. Using this will allow you to fuse the runestone into your weapon I gave you earlier. Okay. Uh, to buy some abilities from this guy. Healing Twilight. Oh, this is a healing ab uh, runestone. That's great. Oh uh, man, S ability to skin skin course. This will be great. Poison blade. Ability to paralyze. Harvest scopes, one gold. Fire grenade. Oh man, wait a second. These are the requirements. Thank you. Wait a second. Uh, oh, this is what I have. Armor class 5. Okay. Uh, oh my god, look at that. <laughs> okay. And what give me that? Wait a second. 
uh, armor class 1, wisdom 1, magic 1 will increase with one weight. Armor class 5. No, this is the requirement. Wisdom 1, magic 1. Uh, but why don't give me one armor class? Oh, I have six. Oh, 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 it's not a requirement. It's what you need. Okay, wait. What are you looking for? Uh, give me these boots. Oh no, it's a pants. Fuck. That was a mistake. Thank you. I have only two more goals. Ability tomb skin course. How to learn that? Require level ten. Oh my god, what a stupidity I made. Fucking hell. What are you looking for? I didn't sew that. I, I bought a level 10 ability. Let me Thank test. you. What? You are not high enough? Require level 3. Require place manipulator. Require Clay's Ranger, requires Clay's Ranger. Oh my god, what, what mistakes I made. Holy shit, I can sell it back. What are you looking for? I sell for almost nothing, man. And for my fucking class, from a romancer. Thank you. Wait. Uh, and now... What is that? Give your enemy ugly flowers for their own destruction. A poison dot meant to be placed on the feet of the enemy. Oh, this is a skill, man. Drop a poison on the blade to kill the enemy quickly. There's a poison... 
damage the armor and dot to weaken your enemy with a melee attack. Okay, that's good. That's basically cast time in stand. Focus cost 30 and calm down 10. Boost your allies bonuses and re regenerate capability. Uh, that's a buff. Cannot put on F5. Hey. Cannot remove from 4. Uh, where I can see the buff? Mana? Don't regenerate? Very slow. Uh, where I can see the buff effect? I don't see the buff effect. I need to double check. Bad that I crafted. I eat it. I don't know how uh, this magic work exactly. But let's try to go in town to add uh, a rune on the weapon. I think, I don't know if that healing will be a passive ability or a, a skill ability as well. Let's see if I can add the rune on uh... But I need to find that it needs to be some kind of workbench uh... Where the hell will be? me now this is an alchemy bench Buy, but 
smithing, metal forging. Uh, oh, here you are. Fusion and attachment. Keep the weapon. Okay. Ability now? Or by the fool? Bring for a small healing spell for your closest ally and you don't have a lie. Heal yourself. like the class that I choose is some kind of <laughs> some kind of killer It looks so cool, honestly. But uh, from what I see, this is that kind of game that, honestly, I don't think you want to play a lot because you'll be very greedy to level up, to level up every profession. I have no idea. If that room will heal myself. I don't think. But don't appear here. enough points available? Oh, points available zero. And where, where, where are going my points? When, when I level up, I don't get points in anything.
That's weird. How many? I want to get that fucking bow. Well, I have six, I still need four. Yeah, a little bit weird. Combat. Let's see. Okay, I need a ton of mana, man, that's some kind of trap. Ability 3. Wow, I need a lot of mana regeneration. A lot. And uh, when I mean a lot, it's a lot. I don't remember where I found that chest with one platinum. Maybe that chest is found. I think behind that tower. I wonder if that chest respawn. Oh no no no, down here in that village. No, don't respawn. I think here I found the chest. Somewhere here. Don't respawn. Goblin is still inside here. Yeah. I poisoned him. No loot again, motherfucker. Can I fish? Let's explore a little bit. Before the end. Oh, 
Or Cooper. And I don't know how to use the teleportation to go back to your uh where you bind. Wow, that's a big mushroom. Hello, you are friendly people? That's a big fucking mushroom. What's that? Poison? Oh my gosh, wow! Hey! That's a big beast. When the fruit apple bomb. Hey, hello. Hello big guy. That's so cute. Sweet vanilla. Provide a three percent boost of to your experience for thirty minutes. That's a good buff. That is one gold, man. You can climb up this ladder? Are you kidding me? I don't know, it's a bug or that's mint Oh fuck! Almost died! Lol man! I think I took 90 damage from falling. Then I climbed here. Die from falling damage. That's a, a stupid way to die. My god. Stupid way to die, man. Another Cooper. I can get that 10 coopers. I think one more spawn close to I don't know if they take damage from that plant. Thimbleberry. How many people I have? I have 10, I can get a bow. I can get the bow. 
from that guy over there. The problem is the ability from my weapon heal my ally. So I think this class that I pick up it's uh it's the healer in game. Is the healer? That sound is broken, man. I don't see any curl here. Did you get the ores I requested? Basic bow. Uh, and where I need to equip? Oh. So you switch your weapon Oh man, how to Hit a fucking snake But not for snakes. Let's explore a little bit more. Let's go where uh, where I died. In that other location. Damn hard. Have a range. You need to target first. Are you kidding me, man? Yeah, the problem is the healing from the weapon is for a lie, not heal myself. I will heal the closest a lie. So this is a wrong class. I think for a solo playing. This is good for a team playing.
We need to work more on the sound. A little bit of the UI. The graphic looks good. The everything that is here is a little bit too static. I think I think in the villages, but I understand. I'm I I know the budget. I'm sure they don't have a triple A budget to to use cool animations and uh, you know that kind of stuff but like i say the game the inspiration for the game is everquest and uh, in games like this not uh, it's not that important that kind of stuff I can find a chest, a hidden chest somewhere here. Try to explore a little bit more. Uh what is here? The dungeon? Who died here? Uh, here is some kind of dungeon. I lie my head to rest and I'm doing so. Lie at your feet, the feet I have in. Would it be cool that to be some kind of puzzle? Hey guys, you have some, you have a chest for me, some hidden loot, no, okay. Oh, that Cooper dispounds so quickly here. I think for acting it's a good uh, profession to make money in the game. Cemetery. Uh, where, where are the undead? Where are the undead? Oh, they are level three here. It's not that bad. Okay. Level six mobs. Hey, bunny. How much the enemy keep the aggro? I wonder. How long? Till 
follow you forever until you kill them or they lose the aggro at one point oh fucking hell let's see we will we'll pass now get the hell out of here okay they lose the aggro at one point Level 6 What's up here? Silver, pretty hard. That's another village. Yeah, I see. I'm sure, I know, it's alpha, it's still alpha. Maybe they will add more, uh, some villagers here to have some basic activities. Because it looks amazing, looks great, but everything looks a little bit too static. What are you looking for? Oh. Oh, looks like the blue saddish you, you can loot, you can uh, find on the ground. Onion. Thank you. Maybe it's another village. These assets, because I'm sure are assets. That's my chest, man. Are amazing. Fit very, very well in the in the world. Tether. A tavern, but nothing inside. Yeah, the game need more interactions or more, I don't know, some kind of random loot, for example, to find something here, some a little bit too empty at the moment, but I think it's too early in development. I really, really hope this game to succeed because I, I love it. I like it. I like what I see. I love the idea. This, you can feel the EverQuest 
five, by the way. Here we go to another area. I think it's another area. Action volley. Oh, much more frames here. Here I have 100 frames. Wow. Man, that looks so fucking cool. That looks amazing. Looks great. Wow. Man, it looks amazing. Bro. Palavina, this guy give a quest. I'm sure I'm too early here. I'm naked. But I'm impressed, I'm impressed, the graphic looks amazing. Okay guys. The first impression about the game... It's over my expectations, honestly. I'm glad I got the opportunity to, to try this game. I didn't hear about this game until two days ago when I uh, received the email to, to participate in the, this playtest. You really feel the EverQuest uh, inspiration in the game. Of course, you need a lot of things to be added in the game. Need, like I said, feel a little bit in the town, especially in, uh, in villages. I really, really love that asset, the, the, the design feel. It's from there, but uh, a little bit too static. That's my only complaint. The graphic looks amazing over my expectations. Uh, looks complex with a lot of skills, a lot of abilities, every profession. You need to spend points to learn, to advance. Uh, the class that I pick up looks like it's a it's some kind of healer. So I don't think it's a good class for a uh, whole of playing. Anyway, anyway, I really have hopes from this game, have expectations. I will uh, follow very very close this MMORPG to to see the developments yeah you can add yourselves guys the game on a wishlist on Steam and maybe I don't know if you can request the access for the playtest I think they will do a lot of playtest until uh, until the full release but it looks looks playable looks more than playable 
it's a uh, it's okay i'm glad i i tried this uh, this game which i never heard about before i really really have hopes in the mmorpg genre i have hopes only from ashes of creations and now this one more than a lot of triple a games because is that you, you feel that chilling vibes from old school mmorpg from old school uh, everquest vanguard saga of heroes i don't know how many of you remember that game was very very long time ago in the warcraft era release anyway thank you very much guys for uh, watching please subscribe uh, to youtube channel if you enjoy the content check the channel we have a hundred of games that we're testing on the channel a lot of playthrough as well especially focused on rpg games but we have a lot of mmorpg a lot of survival games as well anyway thank you very much for watching and see you next time